Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. I've been posting a couple of videos over the last two weeks about the Microsoft Edge browser war that keeps intensifying and just continues. And you can go check out those videos which I have posted over the last two weeks. Now, this is just another update video to the Edge browser war where if you have installed the latest Patch Tuesday cumulative updates for both Windows 10 and 11 that rolled out earlier this week, and for Windows 11, that would be KB5008215, and for Windows 10, that would be KB5008212. Behind the scenes, those two updates have actually now blocked um, any workarounds used by Edge Deflector and Firefox that were used uh, to force links open in a browser other than the Microsoft Edge browser. Now, as many of you know, in Windows, Microsoft uses the Microsoft Edge protocol to force links um, open in Edge. So as an example, if you go to your widgets in Windows 11 and you click on a link, by default, that link will open in the Edge browser. Now, if you didn't know, the Edge Deflector was a free tool that would redirect links to another browser of your choice when you clicked on links in Windows other than Microsoft Edge. So this just looks like the browser war is escalating and also um, Firefox now, they also had a workaround as many of you know, and that also now um, has been blocked with those two recent updates, KB5008215 and KB5008212. So it'll be interesting to see how Microsoft handles this in the future, because I'm sure there is going to be more software developers who will um, bring out tools similar to Edge Deflector. There are also one or two others that are currently available, but I'm, we would be interested to see how Microsoft actually handles these tools going forward in the future, as Microsoft clearly wants to make Edge the default browser, as I have posted over the last couple of weeks in the Windows operating system. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.